All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to another Q&A Sunday. We started this off and we forgot to hit record on the camera. So we got through the first couple questions like, and we were like- Like three minutes into it. Yeah, and, like, and we were uh... like, and I was like, why is the camera saying auto power off? And I was like, oh my gosh, I forgot to hit record. Um, so guys, uh, but one thing that we might change up on this, uh, we're gonna ask your questions. Just leave a comment on what you think. Uh, we might have gameplay in the background and stuff you know, of us playing, well, as the video. Uh, like yeah. as the video, like of Halo or something, playing campaign level or multiplayer or something like that. And us like up in the side little corner, kind of like what live streams, whenever people, you know, have like a little yeah. face cam or something, us in the corner that talking just like this. So, so you're not much. seeing this whole thing like this. You might see some gameplay also, but of course this, it will be just up, you know, smaller in the top. Uh, so if y'all would like to see that, uh, then just go ahead and leave a comment. Just be like, hey, yeah, I would like to see that. You know, if the other option was us and then game playing the, yeah, the corner, but, but yeah, why would you do? Eh, it'd be put better, a small it'd be game better the, the other way yeah. or not change it yeah. at all. We're either would you like to keep it how it is now or do the gameplay with us in the little corner? So just leave a comment on what you think. Um, okay, okay let's so do this again. Do this questions again. Okay, so Corey, he asked, uh, he asked a bunch of questions. Um, what kind of questions do you like the most for your Q and A Sundays? And I short said food, ones. and you said, I said short, short ones, ones, and you said gaming. Uh, and of course, yeah, just I like gaming yeah. stuff. But um, all right, so Lady Kane didn't seem to like the idea of getting a second Xbox, so you didn't have to play a split screen. Uh, was that a joke, or did you really consider getting another Xbox One? That was no. a joke. <laughs> yeah, that was a joke. Now, whenever Halo Five comes out, they are most likely going to do a themed console because they already hinted towards it. Um, so she already knows that I'm going to be most likely getting it. She's not too, she's not like thrilled about it, but she knows I'm going to get it, but I'll probably just sell my other Xbox one and stuff. Um, so since Lady Decane looks behind the dresser when she puts Aiden to bed, uh, did you ever consider having someone hide behind it to scare her? That's mean. Uh, that is, yeah, that's, that's a little too much because I, I don't want to have to deal with that afterwards. Yeah. You know, that'd be terrible. You'd have to put up. With yeah, me. that'd be terrible. So I wouldn't go no, to sleep. no. Um, Were you going to tell them the, the grudge story? Huh? Oh, oh well, there's a grudge story. Um, In college, we just watched The Grudge, and a few days later, uh, I was hiding in a closet. And, you know, Jennifer, like, she came into the room or whatever, and she opened up the closet, and I did the whole little, uh, noise. And, like, I was up high, and then I came out. down, like, yeah, my head sticking out towards her and stuff, and she freaked out. That was funny. So, but I'm sure it backlashed on you then too. Uh, then probably. You had to put up yeah, then I don't. Yeah, yeah. Because then I don't oh, want to well. go anywhere near the closets. So his next oh, question: my. I love Legend of the Seeker, and is based off of my favorite book series, Sword and Truth. Have you ever read the books? If you, uh, if not, would you? They're really different than TV show. TV show. TV show. TV show. Uh, TV show. No, we don't uh, read much. Yeah, we don't read much. I would probably do if we were going on a trip. I would do like an audio book of it. I wouldn't mind that. Yeah, I, um, I like to read, but I already have so many books that are here that I want to read. I don't I just like haven't. to read, so <laughs> like I haven't even read the Harry Potter yeah. books. You know, uh, those I, are the one book series I have read. I yeah, love Harry Potter. There's there's a lot of books um, I want to read, so I I don't think I would add to that list yeah. yet. So next question: uh, What do you love most about Aiden? <gasps> oh, everything. <laughs> yeah, he's great. Uh, he's so love. He's loving. he's a he's a good kid. Yes, yes, there's times where he gets upset. That's any kid. Like whenever well, you get hungry or tired, you're gonna get cranky. Adults and get stuff. cranky. Adults get cranky when they're hungry or tired. So it's understandable. But the deal is, he is really good. Like he's compared so to sweet. like whenever he we go out to places, and thank yes, you and says, please and I love someone you. Someone hands him something, he always says thank he you. He says and good stuff. morning. Yeah. He's very yeah. loving. He loves hugs and yeah. kisses. I love that. Yeah. yeah. We love him. Yeah. Uh, I, we can't pick one thing, I don't yeah. think. So, next question. Is there any specific... Uh, oh, is there I, oh you know what we love most about Aiden? He's ours. He's ours. There you yeah, go. Yeah, he's ours. Um, all right. So, next question. Is there anything specific that you want uh, your second baby to be like? Like, uh, be like his older brother, have blonde hair, blue eyes. Blue eyes. Oh, yeah, we would like blue eyes. We want Aiden to have blue eyes. And actually... Because yeah, I have blue eyes and she has brown eyes, but brown eyes are of, dominant. A lot so of babies are Aiden born with eyes. like a blue-gray eyes. Like, you know, it's like a darker blue. It's real pretty. A lot of newborn babies, if you look at them, they have that really pretty darker blue. And Aiden did. And Aiden we were hoping that, that he would yeah. keep the blue and it would but just no. kind of lighten out, but they turned brown. Straight brown. Um, I don't, want, it, I don't really brown care eyes. about the hair. I don't care uh, about the hair. Yeah. 
Blue eyes are the weakest. I mean, I don't care like, about the eyes. Blue either, eyes but... are the, like, out of all the colors, like green and, you know, yeah. all that stuff, like, blue eyes are the weakest. Like, I, think the most Aiden was a, I think Aiden was an easy, sweet baby. So I would say if we want Tyler to be like anything, it would be to yeah. be to be sweet like his yeah. big brother. So, all right. So what are your bedtimes? For Aiden around 9.30? Uh, Me around Jennifer, 10 or 10.30. Right or... after Aiden goes to sleep. Yeah. yeah. You know, so. Unless I stay up for a while with you. Yeah, him. which most of the time during the week, though, you don't. Yeah, like, cause I gotta Unless up. I go, because I always go in there and I'll lay with her and stuff. And I'll just be watching YouTube on the TV or something like that or watching Netflix asleep. or Hulu. So she may stay up a little bit longer mm-hmm. watching some of the stuff that I watch. But Yes, because he watches uh, stuff I want to watch. Know, so then he I'm, keeps I'm me up. I'm terrible. I'm terrible. Andrew doesn't uh, have My bedtime time. is whenever I go to bed. Normally. Like 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. Normally it's like 3 to 4. 4 a.m. you know is whenever i go to bed there's a, but it depends if i'm working on a video sometimes it have i've been awake i i was going to sleep whenever you were waking up at like yeah. 5 30 and so so that happens sometimes too um all right so if you could improve something about yourself not physically what would it be not physically well uh, i wish i wouldn't be so scared of everything <laughs> yeah i wish i wouldn't get irritated at a lot of stuff Mm-hmm. I guess that would be. It'd be a less stressful life. Yeah, yeah. I would get uh, there. You go. I wish I wouldn't get as stressed, stressed. and stuff yeah. too. Because that's yeah. That's not. Uh, what is your biggest fear? Hers is spiders. Oh no! But that's not big. No, 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 fear. no. Losing your eyesight. Because uh, you talk about how that would be terrible, well, which yeah, it would be terrible. It would be. It's it's. Uh, that would be awful. I would rather I like lose hearing really than hard. lose my eyesight. Yeah, I feel like that know? would be really hard. I don't know if that's my biggest fear, though. I think... I would probably rather lose a hand than lose I my think, eyesight. I think, like, I think... And I know I shouldn't think about this but it's because it's very morbid, but I always think it would be horrible to die a death where you know you're dying, like, to, oh, to like drown suffocating or suffocate. Or, yeah, which that's the same. And I do think about that sometimes. <laughs> or, like, get into a horrible car accident where you... I don't know. Like, I guess sometimes it's Yeah, you're it's trapped good. in there or something, and you're bleeding out, and you're like, uh, I don't know if it's whatever. good to know that you're dying, or it's good for it to just happen. Yeah, that, I don't would, know. that would be... That scares me. My biggest fear is losing I mean, my family. Yes. No, not my parents. No. I'm talking about you. <laughs> yes, Maybe. I do worry about no, but, y'all's safety. Well, yeah, yeah, like, really, like, of course I care about my parents, but not as much as y'all. Like, you know, whenever you drive into work, especially, like, you know, you're pregnant, too, and so that's, mm-hmm. like, two people, you know, right mm-hmm. there. So that's, you know, I don't worry about that. But okay. Don't say you don't care about your parents as much as us. It's just you, you're you with us every day. So it's more of an impact on your well, life if something yeah. was to happen to us. Yeah. But you're, you're like my immediate family. Like, okay. You know, so of yeah. course, of course, like it's like your parents or my parents or something. They love each other more than they love their parents. They still love their parents, but they still love each other more. You know, I don't like saying that. Okay, I don't mind. What is your what? Um, all right. So, what is your biggest, biggest dream? dream? Um, uh, win the lottery. Is that really a dream of yours, though? I just want to. <laughs> I don't know. Biggest dream? My biggest dream is just to have a a, a nice house a good life, a nice school district. Really, I know this happy, is all cheesy kids. and stuff, but yeah. yeah, it's like really to have a good life, not a mm-hmm. stressed life and stuff where you're always like. You're always worried about everything, Mm -hmm. you know, to just have something that it's, it's fine to worry, but to have it to where you're at least a a little bit comfortable. You want to have a happy, healthy life and for your kids to be happy and healthy. Yeah, seriously. Once you have kids, it's seriously like, you worry about, like I started thinking about Aiden, like driving and, and, you know, even riding his bike. Whenever he gets older, I used to go ride my bike out on the street and stuff and everything. And my parents were inside and like my parents were inside the house and Mm -hmm. stuff. Like whenever I was older and I was going down to my friend's house and, you know, me and my friend, we even made like a trip one day. We like rode our bikes and everything like throughout Mm Katie, like old Katie and stuff. And I was like, if... If Aiden was doing that, I'd be worried that's sick why the know, entire time. That's why time. I know my OCD is going to get worse because you know? I already worry so much about him that I'm always double checking. Yeah. Like last night, I wanted you to go into the bedroom to check him to make sure. Yeah, I know. He yeah. was okay because he wasn't moving for a while. Yeah, he didn't move for a while. And so was she like, was like, should you go on check him. on him? I was like, he's fine. <laughs> And uh, so it's just going to get worse. Yeah. Because then, so, then he'll be driving a car, riding a bike. Yeah. yeah. Ew. Next question. Uh, Duquesne, uh, you said you like cowboy hats. Uh, you have one. 
uh, in your emblem, yes, and you live in Texas. Uh, so why do you not wear one? Why, or do, you why not do you not own, own or, or wear, wear one, one every uh, once in a while? Because you, well, I just, have, I'm not. You have a straw cowboy hat, but that's for I'm not a country not, type of person. You're not a cowboy. No, I'm not. And it doesn't suit me either. The yeah. the look it doesn't suit it's me. It's Texas. People don't just you know, all, all yeah. walk around wearing cowboy hats. I I like the I like the cowboys and I like I'm very proud to be a Texan and stuff. Mm-hmm. And so of course like I like all the cowboy hats. Like I you like, lo- all, you I like, like the cowboy. Texas. I like the typical Texas things of like, you know, like w- the stereotypes of riding horses, mm-hmm. the the cattle, you know, and things like that. I like all that stuff, but that's stuff that I br- I'm a city boy. Like mm-hmm. really like I, I still like all the country stuff. Like I go hiking and camping all that stuff, but like I was, I'm not like a rancher or you know yeah. like a cowboy or something like you that. You have no need to wear a cowboy hat. Yeah. People who wear cowboy hats, y'all like, don't, y'all don't understand. It's like people it's, who have big trucks that don't use yeah. big trucks. A lot of people who wear cowboy they hats, they're used. wearing it for a purpose. Yeah. Yeah. They're working out in the hot sun. They're yeah. They, I mean, it's to keep the dust out of their face. Yeah. Whenever they're, they have reasons for wearing those. Yeah. And you do wear a cowboy hat whenever you whenever mow the I lawn, mow. but it's a straw cowboy hat. It's not yeah, the it's one. Not it's not kind of. It's not a cowboy hat. Nice. It's not the cowboy hat you're thinking yeah. of. So, yeah. But there you go. Um, what do you think would be the worst thing to be allergic to? Some examples, tomato, milk, peanuts, corn. It would be mm. tough, like dairy products. Oh, dairy. That's um, everything. No, but I knew a cat. I don't know if humans have this, but I knew a cat that was allergic to grass. That would be pretty bad. That would be pretty bad if it was. But I don't some know if that affects just, humans. Some people though. are just allergic to outside because yeah. of everything outside. Some people are crazy. Like they, what was it? Like they get intense sunburns. Like they can't go outside for that long at all. To like the it's, sun? it's like literally like they go outside for ten minutes and they have like a sunburn or something. Oh yeah, that They're would be They're extremely bad. like whatever. I don't know what to call it. Yeah, but, I would think. Yeah. I would think dairy when it comes to food. Dairy, yeah, it comes to food. That'd be tough. But just because it's in so, so many, many products, it's in so many amazing products, and we and we like you know? real milk and we like real cheese. We don't like all this yeah soy soy stuff and all that. We tried it. We tried the silk yeah. stuff, and yeah, it's no, not no, milk. No, no, no. It, it doesn't taste as good. And then, I want it from an udder. Yeah, these yeah. come from cow. Yeah, and also, uh, but but for other things like you said, sun that would be yeah that would that's be, really that, a thing. Yeah, well, I don't know if bad. it's an allergy or just whatever. I don't know, like. I was just mentioning something, though. But Okay, so next question. Uh, Lady Duquesne, uh, what do you think of Duquesne's... Uh, what, what would you think of Duquesne's oh, facial hair? Okay. You, See, just, I don't, you I don't, just shaved. I just shaved. His hair doesn't really grow through. It kind of no, grows in patchy. No, it, it's, it's all patchy. If I probably left it for, like, months, mm. it would probably... It wouldn't be, like, a beard or anything. I don't really like it. But it would it. be it would be a little more full, probably. I don't but, really like kissing him and getting poked by his little... yeah. I don't like it because it constantly pokes my neck and everything. Yeah. And I hate that. And I don't really like seeing people with a lot of facial hair eating because it's it's messy. Yeah, I don't know. I just think I think it's kind so. of unsanitary to have facial hair. But I mean, I'm not saying it looks bad. I think some yeah. guys look really nice yeah. with it. But I just don't think I want to be no. kissing up on a guy with all that there. Yeah. So okay, next question. Favorite song? Pieces by Sum Forty One. That was quick. I that's always been my favorite song. So they've already asked that question before, and I yeah. couldn't I couldn't give one couldn't solid answer. answer. She doesn't have a certain song. Pieces I, by Sum Forty One. That's someone, my favorite. That's always been my favorite song for yeah. a long time. Or I could go the distance. Hercules soundtrack. Just just because you just heard it. But I, I that's probably one of my favorite Disney songs of all time, and I love animated stuff. So should I? So should so. I pull out some Anastasia? There you go. Yeah, <laughs> dancing bears. I don't know the rest. Painted wings. Painted wings. These are things from my These memory. These are things. <laughs> what? I re- oh, these are things I remember. I remember. I haven't seen that movie. I haven't seen that movie in so long. Okay. Okay, so uh, if you could create a new vehicle for Halo, what would it be? Hmm. That's tough. They it would be a wheeled UNSC like vehicle. A, they don't have any type of motorcycles. There is like something in whatever, like a, I don't know if it was actual lore or someone just created it or whatever, but I wouldn't be a motorcycle. No. Um, a transformer. <laughs> would it be a ground vehicle uh, or air? It would be a ground vehicle. It's something with traction with wheels because I, I like the, the, mm-hmm. I like the friction of driving on something, not hovering. Yeah. Um, so, I don't know. Something ground-based UNSC. Of course, UNSC. I like UNSC vehicles. Um, Four-wheeled? 
I don't know. It could be six or something, you know? Like a gator. It could be like a gator. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. You know? Like, have it like a, ooh, yeah. Like, it's a little tank, like a little scorpion tank. You know, like a gator, but you're protected in it, kind of like a scorpion tank you're protected in. Uh, but it doesn't have as powerful of a shot. It's maybe like a goshog shot. Like a, there you go, like a, oh my gosh, what's the German tank? There's a German tank that's just like the Not one I'm thinking German. of. No, it's that's, that's German, an American. Um, but there's a German tank. It's like uh, Heitzer, Heitz, Heitzer or something like that. Hitzer, Hitz, Heitz. It's like H, I think it's H-E-I-T-Z-E-R. I'm not sure. But um, Heitzer. Heitzer or something like that. But it's pretty much just like a tank and it's angled. It looks, it, that would be so cool if it was angled like this at the top so it could deflect shots. But it would be, it, but it has a very stationary gun. It could look up and down and a little bit left and right. Or actually, I don't think it could look at all left and right. So you have to turn the entire tank to be able to shoot. So that would be kind of that would be weak. But it's like a goshog type it, of shot. It's weak, it's not, but it's protected. Yeah, it's not as strong as a scorpion tank, so it won't mm -hmm. be a one hit destroy. But it would be a one hit kill off of infantry. But the thing is, though, you literally have to turn the entire tank in order to look left or look right. Yeah. You know, that would be kind of cool. It'd take a little more there skill. There you go. Mm -hmm. And it can have treads just like a tank instead of yeah. having, you know, wheels or something. You know, that would be pretty cool. All right. So, um, uh, if you could only have one type of food, Mexican, Chinese, Italian, uh, for the rest of your life, what would it be? Mexican. Seafood. Seafood. And uh, has there ever been a person you couldn't stand to be around? If yes, what is he or she like? Eh, no, I don't think I so. Not that couldn't stand to be around. Stand. I'm pretty tolerant. Yeah. So, all right. <laughs> there's, so there's people that have very annoying qualities, but yeah, we're still yeah, we can still spend time with them. All right. So if you had a do over, what would you change about your life? You could change like college major, town you lived in, etc., or whatever. Would yours be college major? No, because then I wouldn't have met you. Like really, mm -hmm. that is the whole how I met you. And my the college uh, that we went to doesn't have like some sort of gaming you know yeah. some sort of graphic design or gaming some sort of gaming type of gr degree okay. or something i want to say i wouldn't change anything but if if i had to pick something to change it might be that uh whenever whenever i did graduate from college yeah instead of going and getting a full-time job just continue on to get like a double major or a master's you know, because I had always yeah. thought about going yeah. back, possibly. Okay. But once you yeah. leave college, you just I don't know you what don't I would wanna, change. You really? don't want to go back. Really, truthfully, I don't know. The only thing that could come to mind that I would want to change is how... And finish college quicker? Huh? <laughs> finish college quicker? Yeah, I could have done that. But that could have affected but, other things. Yeah, that could have affected other things. Who knows? But no, really, though, like something that I think of off the top of my mind, the way I was whenever Halo 4 came out on my channel... Because I didn't time, like oh, I didn't, I didn't appropriate. Born. Whenever Aiden was born, Aiden was born like a couple days before Halo Four came out, and I did not uh, balance my time, like kind of with Halo Four. I could have made videos, but I didn't, and that really, like Halo Four, yes, dropped off the, my channel because people weren't that interested in the custom games and everything. But it was also because of the fact that I didn't upload that much. Mm -hmm. So that really affected all my new subscribers that I got. Start and back stuff. From scratch. Yeah. And so that was a major thing that I wish I would have, you know, changed. That's and good. I would have actually done more. Um All right, so what is the most embarrassing thing that has happened to you? Oh gosh. Even if I could think I about know. it, I don't know if I'd want to say it on camera. Uh right? I don't know what is embarrassing. Um oh well this is hmm. I just think this is stupid, but I guess it could be embarrassing. Um, a naked guy jumped on me. It was a, at a basketball tournament that we had and stuff. Like, a, it was one of my teammates in the typical high school. Just being an idiot. A high school stupid, immature person. While we were sitting there, me and my but friend were sitting there. that was we embarrassing? Well, no, but were I'm just you? saying it could be embarrassing, well, I guess. Well, yeah, people. but, I but just it's think supposed it was to be stupid. something that's embarrassing but, to you. Me and my friend were playing games and stuff. We were at a hotel and everything. And then all of a sudden, one of the guys got undressed inside the bathroom and came running out and jumped on me. And, I, and like, just joking around, like, oh, or whatever. And I was just like, what are you doing? I was like, <laughs> you know, so I guess some people could see that as well, embarrassing. Yeah, but, but it's supposed to be something that was embarrassing. But I don't know if anything is, I can't Did think. Did you ever pee your pants in school? No. I'm sure, I, think, I think I have. 
At least once. At least once. I'm sure I have. Oh, yeah. there is something embarrassing I guess I could say. Whenever I was in elementary, um, I got made fun of by the popular girl in elementary school because I picked my nose. Oh, really? Yeah. That was embarrassing. You know, I thought it was embarrassing whenever I was like, my, come on, everyone picks their nose. Whenever whenever, uh, whenever my water broke with Aiden, I was at work, and I was in the middle of working, and so whenever whenever my water started breaking, I freaked out, and I like grabbed myself, and I started running to the bathroom, and I yelled to one of the girls as I was running to the bathroom, my water just broke, and I just kept running, and I was picturing in my head that I was leaving this big puddle behind me. And, yeah. uh, but actually, whenever I walked back to my desk, I didn't see, I don't think I got any on the floor. I guess my pants had soaked it all up. But I mean, it yeah. was embarrassing, but not really, because it's. What everyone knows your water breaks. You can't control yeah. your water breaks. Oh, well. But I don't know. All right. Maybe, so, maybe we just um, blocked, maybe we blocked those yeah. memories out. All right. So, what is the thing you want most, but you can't have? PewDiePie's yeah. YouTube channel. <laughs> Golly, can I just have that for a month? Yeah. Like, he makes like a million dollars a month. I don't know. What's he makes something want, ridiculous. But that's the thing you want the most? Oh, man. Just have that for a month and just get his revenue well, no, for a month? If it's what you want for the most, it wouldn't be for just a month. You, no. You would want, you know, you know, what you would want the most is for your channel to be that successful. Yeah, that's and true. And you know that yeah. won't happen. No, and I know that won't ever happen. Um, I don't know so. what I want the most, but I know it won't happen. I was just going to say a lot of money, like a millionaire, but it's not that more that, than a millionaire. It's not that that Come can't on, happen. Uh, billionaire can't happen. And not because and not because I want to go out and spend all this money lavishly. You don't have to stress that, about money though. I don't. I don't want to stress yeah. about money. So all right. Yeah. So uh, who can say Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers five times the fastest? Ready. Hold on. We're we're counting. Can we okay. Read, can we read it as we say? Yeah. It? Okay. Hold on. Wait. 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 You're going to start once it hits. Well, no, because then we Zero. have to look at the, the thing. Okay, no, you go. I'm watching. Go. Peter Piper picked a pack of pepper pack. <laughs> Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. 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 Peter Piper That's picked it. a pack of pickled peppers. Oh, you said it. Why well, you messed many? up on the first one? That was eleven I we seconds. We're gonna do it at the same time. No, that was eleven seconds. Quicker. No, we're gonna do this competition. That was eleven seconds. So I'm gonna start at thirty. I'm gonna, on the timer. I'm gonna lose the track of time here. Okay, so you're gonna start at thirty. Start at thirty. All right, so in three seconds. Yeah. Okay. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of people pickled peppers. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickled peppers. Thir- that's nine seconds. Was that five Booyah. times? Yeah. Oh, okay. Booyah. Did you count my first time? Because I kind of yes, I counted up. your first okay. time. Yeah. So don't act like oh well, yeah, I you're better. Be- yeah, you're better at those than I. Am. Okay. So uh, would you rather break the legs or break both arms? Break both legs or break both arms? Um, arms. I say legs. Arms. Well, no, because then I can't play video games. Oh, hey, Legs. No, no, no. This is what you need to think about. But do you want somebody to have to wipe you in the bathroom? <laughs> I'm just saying. No, your arms. No, but you, you yeah, eat but with the your thing arms, is though, you the break of a, the break of your like your femur or something like that is way worse than an arm because it's such a thicker bone. Yes, but just um, the recovery. Okay, if you though, just if you just been like poof. Your legs are broken and you're in and a cast, in cast or whatever. <laughs> Definitely legs. But it makes me think, though, like, ugh. Like, just because I've broken my wrist and my ankle and stuff. And no, my ankle was much your worse. Legs, so you don't know how bad. I broke my ankle. Oh, well. And that was that felt way worse than my wrist. Well, yeah, pain-wise, I guess you'd rather break your arms. But but really, in the long run, it'd be better to break your legs because yeah. then you'd have use of yeah, your Yeah, because then I could play video games. You could games, wash so. yourself. Yeah. You could use a bathroom. You could nope, brush your own teeth. No, you're still going to have to wash me if I break my legs. <laughs> you could play video games. Yeah, you could still but, hug Aiden. All right. So, uh, would you rather not be able to taste or smell? Oh, I would rather not be able to smell. Yeah. I need, I need to taste my food. I, I'm good not being able to smell. Yeah. Jennifer would oh, love that. In I the, would love not being able to yes. smell this one. <laughs> yeah, I, I can't lose my taste. Yeah, I, I got to be able to I taste my macaroni and cheese and my Oreos and my pizza. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> All right, so would you rather have cancer or AIDS? Cancer. Yeah, cancer. Oh, yeah, cancer. It'd be horrible because, going through chemo and doing all that, but well, can, cancer has a treatment. Yeah, it has a treatment and stuff, so... Yeah, I guess so. Uh, would you rather uh, your spouse be one foot taller or one foot shorter? Shorter. Ooh, shorter. You'd rather me be shorter? Yeah. One foot shorter? I'd be four foot five. 
That is pretty short. That is pretty short. I don't want you to be seven foot four. That's but then way you're too tall. taller than me. And seven foot four. Yeah, but then people, you'll be taller than that, me. That's that's too much body. But then for your you'll heart. be taller than me though. It's bad and for your heart. That to me is just kind of weird. I want to be taller than you. Oh yeah, yeah I'd be six foot five. I'd be, be I'd be almost I'd be almost at your level. I guess though. we could stand with each other, and without me bending over, I could kiss. And you can't ask me to always get things off the high shelves. Yeah. Then. So mm-hmm. see. I'd rather you be shorter though, because seven. Foot I guess four, one foot taller. Yeah, that'll it's work. Not healthy. All right. So, did Halo uh, Master Chief Collection Forge live up, live up to your expectations? Yes and no. Um, majorly don't, yes. Don't go too Just crazy with minorly this. Minorly no, because of uh, there's issues with like uh, the race game type, and there's no grab hammer, you know, for uh, but hopefully grip ball people. Be fixed. But yeah, they already. I've already talked to certain Infinity and stuff, and they said that they like. They said thank you for bringing the race game type to our attention. You know, and stuff. Um, they said that there's a glitch in it that caused like extra mm-hmm. like spawn things to mess up the whole spawn gate deal, like the checkpoint spawning. And so they're actually they're working on a fix for but it. But overall, and stuff. it's and it's, so. it's amazing compared to their past. Well, yeah, it's it's way ridiculously better. So okay. yeah, definitely lived up to it. So yeah. Um, I would like to see a group of objects featured in Forged. Uh, what do you want to see group the most? Objects. Group objects. Yeah, that group objects would be nice. Um, also, since we have terrain, you know, I guess you would just say more terrain now with, you know, terrain stuff. Yeah. I would like to see just more terrain pieces You would and like stuff. to see weather. Um, yeah, weather. To be able to have weather in there, to be able to have, just like how the, um, the FX things, like where you can do the pen and ink or, mm-hmm. you know, the, the juicy look, you know, you bring out the exact same thing and it'll say like rain. rain. And Snow. it'll be raining or, you know, thunderstorm or cl- yeah. overcast That'd be or pretty cool. foggy You're or something like that. You're racing a tornado, like there's a tornado going around. That would be awesome. Yeah. Or just, or not even just that, just like fog or yeah. something. Something, you know, moderately simple. That would be awesome. Or a time of day thing where it's just mm-hmm. a slider on the deal and you just slide it and the sun yeah, moves weather, like this. Weather would be more cool though. Yeah, weather definitely. Okay. Weather definitely. All right. So, um, Duquesne, if someone offered you a job based on your college major and you didn't have... Uh, to move, would you take it? Depends on the job, but if I liked it, yeah. Offered you a job, would. he said, best based on your major, yeah. so it'd probably be at a state well, park yeah. or. I'd probably a like, yeah, park. I'd probably take it, you know? Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Uh, do, do you have a oh, job? Oh, for those of you who don't know, his major is natural resource yeah. management. That's like you could be a wildlife biologist, park ranger, things like or that. Natural Stuff resource with specialist. Not, yeah, natural resource yeah. specialist, things like that. Um, all right, so, uh, Duquesne, if 343 offered you a job, would you take it? Duh. I don't care if I have to move up there. She wouldn't like it. Well, but, I just wouldn't like to move so far away. But if I had a job with them and then I could find a job maybe closer in the yeah. future off of something would, else, that would we be would good have to move. We would have to move for that opportunity. But yeah. then, of course, you would probably use that to hopefully find something closer to home. Yeah. I mean, not a, right away, not but right I'm right. just yeah, saying. It would be years, I'm, like, I'm probably, just saying, but still, it yeah. would be. Unless, what if you just loved it up there in Seattle? Mm-hmm. You never know. Oh, Seattle's yeah. awesome. You could be like, oh my gosh, this is where Twilight was filmed, and I love Twilight so much. <laughs> is that where Bella yes. was? Yes, that's why. I, that's where I based where I was. Oh my live. gosh, Edward Cullen walked down this street. <laughs> <laughs> um, have you have you thought, just telling you guys she's not like that about Twilight, <laughs> um, have you thought of getting a P.O. box so people could send you fan mail? Uh, no, I oh. have not. Uh, if enough people would do it, then yeah, I would. But I don't think I'm close to even yeah. being big enough to get anything. It wouldn't be like worth that. spending the money. Yeah, to get a to PO be, box. have a PO box <laughs> for that type of thing. So, all right. So, what do you think of Halo Nightfall? That, so, that's so what far? this is for. We don't need mail. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know, just uh, send me. You know, if you want to send me something, uh, just send me digitally. You know, like a a picture of something that you've drawn, or I don't know, whatever. But you know, what, that? what do you think? Of uh, what do you Nightfall? think of Halo Nightfall? Only, it's only been one episode. Oh, one right? episode. Or has I another don't, one come out? I don't know if no one's come out. Well, so we've only look. watched one episode. We, we only liked watched it. one episode. I liked it. People complain about CGI, but this isn't a full blockbuster movie. Like there is budget restrictions type of thing, and I thought the CGI still looked good. Mm-hmm. You know, it, it's not like the most amazing CGI you've ever seen. And I or, love Ford Unto you know, Dawn. And it I was think still it's going to be good. I thought it was just as good as CGI as Ford Unto Dawn and stuff. I think it's um, going to be good. But, okay, so. I don't know. It, I, the, Ford Unto, the only part of the CGI that I thought uh, looked kind of weird in was Nightfall whenever was, whenever, was, was whenever, on whenever the, the elite was yeah walking on the island. Like you mean he, on the, like in front of first, the water? Yeah, whenever he first walked in front on, like, of the, the bank. pond or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That was a little, eh, but whenever the whenever he was up close. And Locke was it, it shooting him and stuff. I thought it looked pretty good. 
Um, all right, so what do you think about the Halo 5 based on what you've seen? I, I, I'm interested. I'm a little bit worried about, like, I understand they kind of the balanced out line? the sprint. Oh, no. okay. Uh, like, I understand that they, like, balance the sprint because your shields don't recharge whenever you're sprinting, but I'm still a little bit worried with that. Um, I like the fact that you could climb up on legends, ledges and stuff. That's really cool. Um, that could be some for cool custom game type of things, mm -hmm. you know, in there, there is no loadouts. It's all to the, the ADS with quotes around it. Cause it's not really, you know, aim down sights. It's really just the same weapons. It's just like a different type of zoom, like on the BR and stuff. And it has no, I know it has no <laughs> effect, uh, like difference between just shooting normally and looking down and stuff. So it seems like they balanced it. You, you know, so, so, yeah. about this. I don't know. It, it's to me, it I'm seemed interested. interesting. I'm, I'm just going to wait till the beta to have a full, I'm you know, like actually line. thoughts about it. Like what Locke yeah. is looking for him for. Yeah, what did he do? Did he run away? Like what? Like, I just, yeah, I, I want to know yeah. the situation. So is my list of questions longer than Biowolf's? Yes. I think it is, but it's much better. Like the bullet points are so much better. All right. So next uh, question, finally by someone else. Uh, Swirly oh, Kalen. my answer to your question. Uh, my answer to your question, Duquesne. Halo is my favorite game of all time, and I would uh, say it is my dream game, but to make it a perfect dream game, it would need headshot tea bags. Uh, there you go. Mm -hmm. uh, forged similar to Project Spark, unlimited budget, and of course, uh, those hashtags. Uh, if, you, if Halo 2 Anniversary's Forge is as amazing as I hope it is, uh, then I think... That would be my answer. Now, of course, there's a limit to budget and stuff, but it's still really good. Mm. Um, uh, and Duquesne, the ODST who needs revenge, uh, your answer was very good, and I appreciate the details. <laughs> See? They appreciate the details. Mm -hmm. um, also, Duquesne, if you had me as a friend on Xbox One, I'd be super happy because I think we'd get along well as I am pretty good uh, forging. Uh, Here, finish reading Oh, my his. gosh. Okay, so I'm going to finish this real quick because uh, our battery just kind of went. I uh, Also, I'm pretty good at forging, and I'm not uh, just saying that. I've been doing it since Halo 3 and have been uh, featured twice by Battle Block Theater for my mm -hmm. play, uh, playlist Zaplosion, and that's a long word. Um, let's be friends online. Hattenton Bros. Hattenton so, Bros. Hattenton Bros. Okay, we're going to change battery real quick. We'll be back. All right, so um, really... Uh, just, you can follow me on Xbox One. I, the, it's nothing against you. It's nothing against anyone. It's just that I really don't play with a lot of just random people all the time. I play with them some and stuff. But follow me on Xbox One. Um, and I do invite just, you know, if I'm doing like, a, I want to test something or I'm doing game night type of deal. I'll just invite people who are following me and stuff and we can play together. Um, all right. So my question to you, Duquesne, if you could forge a map from any game, uh, that would play well in Halo, what would it be? Mine would be Facility from Goldeneye, uh, which is the first map I will remake since the lighting was off in the Halo 4 version. Um, I don't really know. I don't... Um, how about a Battlefront map? I don't know which Battlefront map. How about one of the space Battlefront maps? Because I really enjoyed those. That was really you fun. anything up in the was, space. Yeah, that was pretty fun. All right, so uh, Duquesne, if you could forge some uh, something beautiful for Lady Duquesne in Halo, what would it? What would you make, and why? Hmm, <laughs> I would make her a Mexican food restaurant, <laughs> and she would be like, "This is the most beautiful thing I have ever seen." I would fall in love all over again. <laughs> yeah. So, all right, so um, Lady Duquesne, what is your favorite forge map that I have made? Hmm, that's tricky because I like a lot of them. Or she can't think of them. Okay, the way, <laughs> no, just, just based off the way they look, and because I'm such a uh, a Nintendo nut, I would have to say the Daisy Cruiser and Yoshi's Island. Yoshi's Circuit, yeah. Yoshi's Circuit, the way they look. Yeah. But um, like me racing on one, I want to say. Uh, was it called Revolution? The one that you oh ended my up gosh, that was into old. your uh, making it into my Wonders of the World. Yeah, that it was one of Dang, your original that was a ones, long and time it was ago. so good. I really liked it. That was a long time I ago. I liked racing that one. Like I actually liked racing on that one. I totally forgot about that map. Yeah, but you've made a lot. That of That was ones. one of my first ones in Reach. Yeah, you've made that a lot was of a good, good ones. One. 
All right, so if you guys were stuck in a video game till the end, uh, what would it be besides Lego or Halo? And if, if we were stuck in a video game? Um, I want to say Donkey Kong because it's tropical and nice and you can eat bananas. Yeah. And, or the new Donkey Kong. Really, the new really Donkey no, Kong has different islands. Like it's yeah. snow and then and, tropical. And, and there's not too many so dangers. Different. I mean, there's dangers, but it's not like... You know, nobody's shooting at you. Project Spark, because then you can make whatever you oh, want. Oh, Project Spark, because then there doesn't have to be any danger. Yeah, you and you can literally whatever, make whatever you want. We can just want. make our house, and we can, can make a mansion. Yeah, you and can do just, whatever you want. Oh, and if you're you like, I want to go on a quest where I find uh, a whole bunch of loot, and then you can make it and go on the there quest. There we go. That's it. Project Spark. Booyah. That that totally, like, ripped his entire question apart. That was good, apart. yeah. Like, all right, so you guys are great. Always wonderful watching your videos. Thank you. Um, all right, so I crush all. Ask uh, Freddie Kane. Sorry for the confusing question last week. If you remember the Spectre from Halo Two, um, are you mad that it isn't in Forge? I'm not necessarily mad, but I'm a little bit disappointed because I wish they added things like the civilian warthog and stuff into there, and that wasn't even in Halo Two. That was just like the whole rumor it was on a billboard thing, and uh, so it would have been nice to add the Halo Two Spectre in there just because it's a vehicle in Halo Two. So why not put it in there? Do you remember you know. his confusing question? No, I don't. Um, so for Lady Duquesne, uh, do you plan on playing Halo 1 through 4 on the Master Chief Collection uh, before Halo 5 Guardian releases next year? Well, I've played probably some. some of I've it. played some with you already. Yeah, you'll probably play some of it. I just don't have as much time. Yeah. So, all right. So for Duquesne and Lady Duquesne, uh, Master Chief Collection just came out on Tuesday and Halo campaigns. Uh, have you started on the... Um, what Halo? Oh, uh, what Halo campaigns have you started on in the collection? If you haven't already, uh, if you haven't started any of them, uh, which uh, one will you start on, or which one is your favorite? You just started Halo Two today. No. Didn't you? No. Oh, were you just playing it? Yeah, again? I was just playing. No, I was continuing it. Oh. There's not just one level in that, the Halo I Two campaign. That was, no, I thought that was the beginning though. That no. You were playing. No. Okay. And uh, I just played Delta Halo, uh, that level, um, but. Uh, yeah, I've just been playing through the Halo 2. I haven't played that much just because I've been forging, like, you mm -hmm. know, and stuff. But I'm going to eventually get through them all and stuff, so, yeah. Oh, you uh, say have a great week. You too. Yeah, it, it was great. It was great. Have a great week. Uh, all right, so Yobin asks, uh, what do you think of the battle rifle design for Halo 5? Um, also, uh, which is your favorite BR aesthetically? Personally, I love the Halo 3 look and really hate the Halo 4 and Halo 5 designs. Um... And then, uh, where would you buy your games if GameStop didn't exist? Okay, so, uh, what do I think the Halo 5? I don't know. It looks different. It looks interesting. I didn't really study it too much, so I don't really... Do you have like, a favorite design? Favorite design is probably... Probably Halo 3s. Like, I, I did like Halo 4s, but yeah, I think I liked Halo 3s better and stuff. Um, or even Halo 2. You'd probably buy your games stuff, online but, uh, if GameStop closed. Uh, yeah, I'd probably just buy them online. Or, no, not for midnight release. I gotta have my midnight release. So maybe, depends on which one has the best, uh, pre order exclusive. Mm -hmm. Really. So you'd probably so, go back yeah. and forth. Yeah. So, all right. So, mine, what is that? Mini Me? My Mini Me. My Mini, mini Me? Uh, 26. How often do you play with random fans? Uh, not. A whole lot, but I still do play. Whenever they get all this matchmaking connectivity issues done, I'll be having game well, nights. You don't, well, you don't even play with your friends that much. I don't even play with my <laughs> friends that much. I'm too busy like foraging and stuff friend. like that yeah, a lot you of don't times. Even... Um, but whenever they get all this connecting issues stuff like that solved, and then I'll most likely be having more game nights, and I'll be willing to more play with people more. You know, if I have the time. But it's like right now, it's so tough with all the connection issues. Uh, why did Robo Vicaro stop making YouTube videos? I don't know. Uh, he got busy. He's Yeah, he got busy with women. <laughs> um, uh, how have... Uh, how have... Uh, um, have you enjoyed uh, the Forge options in Halo 2 Anniversary? Yeah. Yeah, I think they're good. Like all the scripting stuff and everything like that and... Um, just all that stuff, all the different game types of, of like race game types. Yeah, everyone wants more, but what they have is a pretty awesome. You still enjoy what's there. Yeah. All right. So, uh, Temporal Enigma asks, uh, I'm going to test your Halo knowledge uh, with some random Ooh. trivia. The answers will be in the comment section of your video. Cool. Oh, okay. Awesome. So, just telling you, 
I'm not you that did, good at this. He did not read the books. Uh, he I did tried. not read the books. We I, have the books. I tried. I failed. I got tired of reading. They were good books. I just got tired of reading. So don't be too um, disappointed. All right, so, all right. So after the prophet sanctioned the elites to be their guards and military force, uh, they began to convert other species uh, to the force to eventually be known as the covenant. Which species was the first to be converted? I'm going to have to make a guess here. But the deal is, oh, is it, it's, I think it's going to be between, I don't know this. I think it's going to either be between junk, uh, junks, grunts, or jackals. But grunts would be, like, the reason why you would think that they would choose them first is because they're so weak. Mm-hmm. You know, they're so, they, they're, they're very, weak minded. Con- yeah, they're weak minded. You would be able to control them really easily. You wouldn't have to convince them much. Yeah. But then jackals, I think, would be very important to have just because they're actually an annoying enemy, you know, because they're shield. Grunt seems too like an easy of an answer here. Uh, I have no idea. It's probably neither of these. I'll just say grunts. Okay. Um, How many firing modes does the battle rifle have and what are they? Well, it has a three shot burst and uh, can you go single shot? I didn't think so. I thought it was. I thought that was it. I'm confused. I don't firing know. Firing modes. Yeah, but yeah. he says how many firing modes, and he's saying plural. And what are they? You know, are they? So that's plural. So there has unless to be more than. Unless it's a trick one. question. Unless it's a trick question. And, it's just a three and there's shot. just a three shot burst. But I'm thinking in my head, I'm like, is there any Halo games where you can switch it to single shot? Which I'm pretty sure you can't, because that's the whole point of the DMR. Well then. I'm just gonna say trick three question. shot burst. Whatever. If you have a trick question. <laughs> um, all right. So why is the Spectre never seen again after Halo 2? Uh, because. Is that a vehicle? Yeah. Wait, um, which one's the Spectre? The Spectre is the one that right before we got done, you know, playing that one level in Halo 2. The next mission had that one vehicle. Oh, that's the a big Spectre. giant. Big giant deal. It has right. people on the side, right. person driving, person in a gun. What, they destroyed um, them all? Uh, they thought it was pointless because wraiths are better. <laughs> I don't know. I have no idea. All the Spectres were on that Halo ring and it blew up. I don't know. I'm just throwing out stuff. I have no idea. Uh, which monitor uh, has an Easter egg in its name and what is it? 343 Guilty Spark, because 343. <laughs> I have no idea. That's the only monitor I know. So, um, I know there's other ones, but that's the only one. That, uh, what is the difference between longsword, uh, short sword, and broadsword? All right. Is it a longsword? No. Or is it... Longsword might be the one that Chief flew off in at the end of Halo 1. She's looking at me like... <laughs> You're, good luck on this. Mm-hmm. Uh, longsword might be the one. Is I think a longsword was the one that Chief flew off in at the end of Halo One. Uh, is the broadsword? Is it a? See, all I could do is I know there's something. Is there a broadsword so or the something? Ships are called yeah, they're the long- planes or oh. whatever I think. And uh, the broadsword in ODST it, wasn't there one that wrecked and blew up or something. Was that a broadsword? I don't remember. Um, I might just be throwing stuff out. I have no idea. I'm just throwing all this stuff. Uh, what game is the uh, Seraph uh, Covenant Heavy Fighter Ship uh, first featured in? Halo 2. Um, what is the actual name of the Covenant dropships? Not the Phantom, the other one. Were you going to say oh, the Phantom? <laughs> yeah, it was. He's talking. Are you talking about the original, like the Halo 1s, like the deals that look like a tuning fork? You know, like it's literally like just like two prongs coming out and then the gun. The phantoms are the ones that look kind of like mm-hmm. the, the arching type of deal. Uh, uh, Covenant dropship. Because <laughs> they always go, Covenant dropship inbound. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, so what is the name of the buried vehicle mm-hmm. on Sand Trap in Halo 3? And uh, what was it used for? That's where the Banshee spawns. And was it a Scarab? Was it a Scarab that was there? I don't remember. Was it a Scarab? What was it used for? 
I don't know, blow up stuff? <laughs> I don't know what if it was a scarab or not. I don't know. Uh, what is 343's excuse for why Cortana looks different in every Halo game? Uh, fans uh, will know it's just a, this, the series evolving, but they have created an answer within the lore. Um, didn't she, like, upgrade herself and stuff? I thought she did that between Halo 3 and Halo 4 while Chief was in the cryo. Uh, I thought I thought she upgraded herself and everything. I don't know. I can't remember. <laughs> um, the Covenant anti-air assault, uh, anti-air turrets in Halo 3 um, and Halo Reach have names. What are they? Hint, they are different and uh, Halo 3's is name um, vehicle. The anti-air turrets. Are there, are you talking about those tanks? The, the anti-air ones? That like that one level you have to go in, you have to destroy them, and then the uh, the ship comes flying down and like pushes everything away, and then they drop a couple tanks, like scorpion tanks and warthogs in there, like after you destroy them. I don't know what they're called. Because they have names. I don't know what they're called. I one, just, of, one of them is the I same just as go, a vehicle. I just go anti-air wraith. Because that's what it is. It's a wraith with an anti-air gun on it. So, see, I don't know any of these. I know you, you, you I'm failed. Ter- I, I epically failed. I, I can already tell you, you failed. I, I don't, failed. Even, I don't even have to look at the answers. I did fail. I did, I did, but I don't really care. So <laughs> that's it. Um, thanks everyone for watching. Uh, again, guys, uh, just leave a comment if you would like to see gameplay in the background and us in the little corner and stuff uh talking or do you want to keep it just like this uh if you want to ask a question go down to link in the description to forgechannel.com there's a little section the the links there in the description and stuff and we will um, ask y'all a question what and is what is your biggest fear what is your biggest that would have been a good Ooh. halloween for Hall- that would have been halloween a good week. halloween one but That's it's okay. not halloween so it doesn't matter what's your biggest uh fear? yeah so what is your biggest fear and uh yeah so guys um hopefully 343 gets the file share system working and stuff. That's another thing that really needs to be fixed uh, so we can download other people's maps because I want, you know, like there's people that want to post maps on Forge channel, but there's no way to download them. So it's just kind of like, well, I might as well wait till, you know, got to download it. But yeah, so guys, thanks for uh, watching and we will see y'all next time. Bye. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Bye. Bye.